Hey guys, Drew from Guitar Player U. Something I wanted to mention, very, very important. The guitar you use does make a difference. Uh, it's often said that a great player can make any guitar sound great, and there is some truth in that. However, when you're first starting out, and uh, you have a guitar that you bought at a yard sale that you know is 200 years old and the strings are this high off the neck, that's going to be pretty hard to play with. Uh, for this course, that's why I chose this guitar. This is a $100 Fender acoustic. And, you know, right next to me I have some amazing guitars, you know, all around me. But I really wanted to share with your pain and have, maybe not having the best guitar to play, and that's okay. But one thing you should be aware of is something called action. And action is the distance between the string and the fretboard. And if the strings are too high, you have to push really, really hard. And it makes it really, really difficult to start to learn to play. Now, if it's a guitar you bought at Guitar Center or a big, you know, retailer, you're probably fine. But you may want to double check that your action's not too high. And you can do that by taking your guitar to any guitar shop, having a tech look at it. And it's something that can be adjusted. So I do recommend getting your guitar set up by a professional, you know, if you're not sure about it or if it's giving you trouble or if it's really, really, really hard to play. Or if you know anybody who's got a guitar that you can try out. You could compare yours to theirs, that sort of thing. But you may be wondering why I'm using this guitar for this course. It was simply to kind of sympathize with what you guys are going through. Using a beginner guitar for a beginner guitar course only makes sense, right? Well, thanks for purchasing our course. Can't wait to hear what you guys think about it. Make sure you reach out to us and let us know how we're doing. Take care.